हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू योर चैनल आर्ट ऑफ मैथमेटिका सी टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डू चैप्टर टेन डेफिनेटली क्लास सेवन चैप्टर टेन वर्कशीट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर टू दैट क्वेश्चन नंबर टू बिफोर डूइंग द कंस्ट्रक्शन लेट मी शो यू द राफ वर्क सो बी सी लेंथ गिवेन दैट इज वर्ट एट सेंटीमीटर दिस इज बी सी सो इफ यू ज्वाइन इट इट शुड बी ए सो एंगल ए इज फिफ्टी डिग्री this one is also 50 degree but tell me is it possible to construct directly no why simply be, whenever you are going to do na first you are going to draw uh, any ray then from the point b you have to cut bc that is 8 cm hai na this one now from the point b by copied angle like this you can draw uh, 50 degree but from this should be c na because bc length is 8 cm so this should be c, uh, c this point so here you cannot draw 50 degree because angle a has been given 50 degree angle c is not given 50 degree understood na so so what to do so and 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 you don't know the length of ab also so you cannot uh, get a point that this is a point now from here you will draw 50 degree and join it not possible so what to do just by angle sum property you have to find the remaining angle so 180 degree is total sum this to sum is what 50 degree plus 50 degree that is 180 minus 100 80 degree no now this should be angle c because a 50 b 50 so remaining is what c that is now you have 80 degree is the angle c no now from the point c you have to draw 80 degree angle and join and extend okay like this if you have not understood what to do listen it again so now from the point c you have to join it now what to do like copied angle here you have to draw 50 degree angle separately you know na copied angle how to do that is 50 degree and that one is 80 degree suppose so from here copied angle by and and definitely inside copied angle should be drawn inside because angle c is what this side or that side this side is 80 degree so there so like this and cut it join this is 80 degree so automatically you will get angle uh, means point a and this is the required triangle understood the rough work so let's see how to uh, do the construction again i am going to show you by uh, doing construction so let's start question number 2 of box sheet 3 draw a triangle abc in which bc equals to 8 cm angle b equals to 50 degree angle a equals to also 50 degree okay also bisect angle a and angle c so uh, again the same as the previous angle uh, 50 degree i have to draw by copied angle then uh, i have to do the remaining part so uh, i am going to do this one first so if i want to draw copied angle so i need uh, some a protector then from there line this is our 50 degree remember next here it is 50 degree can you see that you have to do by using scale uh, 50 degree angle so this is our 50 degree again you are not going to do 50 degree uh, draw 50 degree angle because both the angles are same so why should i draw again the same angle so it is better to draw one time this is 50 degree this is a only and this is b only okay this angle is a only this angle is b only okay now uh, i have to draw bc as a 8 cm so i am doing it directly using scale here it is uh, shall i do here ha huh? shall i do it yeah so need a compass what to do draw 8 cm Eight. Now this is eight. You can see it. This is eight, no? So first draw a ray. 
then I am going to cut this out. Rim is there uh, from the point O. I have to cut any uh, ray. I have to take actually any ray. Chalo. Again, now this is our 8, uh, eight centimeter. So put the compass here and just cut it. Here it is 8 centimeter. 8 centimeter taken. So this is given the name. The name is given BC. So I am going to write here B and there is C. This is 8 centimeter okay after this done now what i have told that b at the point b or at the vertex b you have to draw the angle b and at the vertex c you have to draw angle c but here angle a so not possible but i have told you in my previous video only previous class that uh, sum of three ang uh, angles in a triangle you know that is 180 degree angle is there can you find the remaining one yeah definitely you can find the remaining one so let us first find it okay so here i'm going to do the calculation from angle sum property we know like this we are going to write from angle sum property what to say angle a plus angle b plus angle c equals to 180 degree. Now, now angle A given 50 degree. So write down in the place of angle A 50 degree. Angle B also 50 degree. 50 degree plus angle C as it is 180 degree implies. Now, angle C equals to. 180 degree now this if you add you will get 100 so minus 100 degree actually you know now this is 80 degree so angle c equals to 80 degree so actually at the point c now i have to draw 80 degree angle so uh, 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 achha, do one thing i have to shift this point okay i have to shift this point just a minute i have to rub this because i don't have a space over there so i am going to rub and i am going to do here okay so uh, let me again that uh, again i have to do the same thing because i don't have the space i ha i need a space to draw a uh, 50 degree 80 degree angle and before that uh, here 50 degree drawn now so in that place i am going to draw 80 degree because 80 degree is also there So draw it first line. This one is 80. From this point, join it. Now this is our 80 degree. Okay. So uh, let me write. 80 degree and BC is there that means I need angle B so I am going to take this as a B A B C that one is C so A C B okay done now I have 80 degree and 50 degree so be careful when C again let me clear this one BC given 8 centimeter. So if you draw BC na, at the point B you can draw angle B. Okay, it's okay. But at the point C you have to draw angle angle C only, not angle A. Angle A you cannot draw at the point C. So I need the uh, measurement of the angle C. That is by this uh, remaining angle you can find or, or angle some property rather you can say it is 80 degree. Okay na? So now this is 50, this is 80 degree. Understood? Now what to do? Now uh, draw BC and at the point B draw 50 degree at the point C draw 50 degree. Okay. So draw BC. So I need a ray. 
anyway i have to draw first now already 8 cm taken i am not going to take it again here it is now i am going to cut it this is our 8 cm again i have i had to draw what should i do this is b this one c 8 cm now you all know as that i have done earlier also that by copy angle you have to draw 80 degree and 50 degree so let me draw a 50 degree angle first first draw arc now this arc only i have to draw here this one now cut it here it is so i have to measure it and check uh, perfectly done put the compass here and cut it okay now what to do join these two point you will get the 50 degree angle as i have told you earlier also the same thing same concept no solid line i have to take and what you are going to do using scale you are joining it okay and join and extend and see again i have to say this is not the line this is also not the line this is also not this is also wrong this one it should be passes through the intersecting point now done now from the point c i have to draw 80 degree angle what to do simply put the compass here and cut the arc this and remember in my previous video i have told that in which side you have to cut the arc inside because triangle is forming like this no so that means inside if you have not seen my previous video see it i have explained over there properly so this side i have to uh, cut it so be careful all of you don't make the mistake over there now i have to measure it yeah okay correct na ha now put the compass this where blue color and the black arc intersect here it is and cut it here is the meeting point and here see and join and extend again the same concept same thing i have to do now put and see join the line it shouldn't be like this it should be like this okay na be careful here it is here it is so this is the point a na So what to write? This is A. This is our required triangle. Okay, so be careful. Now, still question has not yet completed. What they have told? They have told bisect angle A and angle C. So I am going to do angle C first. I am going to bisect angle C first. Okay. So take the compass again. And already this arc has been taken. So from this point, uh, let us change the color. This one I am going to take a oh, red color. Chalo. Now cut it. This side done. Now opposite side I have to take. and just cut it and if i join them i'll get the angle bisected simply this and this so be careful all of you be careful this is the angle bisected see so that means this is our uh, angle bisector of angle c now what to do they are told angle bisector of a also so this is the point a and there is no arc so first what to do i have to cut the arc put the compass here and 
can cut any arc any radius you can take i have taken 2.4 so any radius you can take then what to do then put the compass here and cut it okay so shall i change the color so let's change the color it is better so that you can understand okay i'm taking violet color so here it is and now let's put the compass here and cut this one this one now you can see here is the meeting point and this a i have to join them i am taking dotted line so that you can understand this is our angle bisect and it should passes through like so it shouldn't passes uh, like this it passes like this their meeting point means this is the meeting point so it passes through this not there not uh, outside it passes through their meeting point and join them and extend okay this is our angle bisector of angle a so these two done so i hope you all understand i hope you like this video if you like this video please share with your friends those who are new to this channel please subscribe to the channel tab tak ke liye all of you take care and one more thing in my next video i am going to do the remaining part of the sum of this worksheet so after that i am going to start worksheet 4 so tab tak ke liye all of you again i have to say take care and goodbye